Podcast is awesome and I love it so. There's still lots and lots of things science don't know. Science is awesome. Hello, my name is Christy. And my name is Angelina. And you're watching Science is Awesome. Today we're going to be looking at propulsion. Propulsion means to drive an object forward and push an object forward. There are many examples of propulsion. Moving cars, bikes, rollerblades, scooters, planes, jet skis, and boats. But today we are looking at geysers and rockets. A geyser is an explosive fountain of water which shoots up from the ground and into the air. A rocket is a cylindrical object which propels in space. And today we got two cool experiments to show you each type of propulsion. First up, Mentor's geyser. For this experiment, we will need a bottle of sugar-free soda, a pack of Mentos, optional, a miniature geyser field. Simply drop a few Mentos into the bottle of soda and watch the crazy reaction. The science bit. What happens here is called nucleation. All the fizz carbon dioxide in the sprite is squeezed into the liquid and looking for a way out. All the pressure has to go somewhere and the only way is up. Now for the rocket propulsion experiment. Space rockets are usually blasted into space with rocket fuel, but today we're only going to be needing water and air. For this experiment, we will need a bicycle pump, another plastic bottle, water, and some strength. Wait, the pet pig geyser field isn't in this experiment. Take it out! Okay. A bicycle pump, another plastic bottle, water, and some strength. Fill one third of the bottle rocket with washer, attach the pump to the bottle rocket, pump like crazy, and blast off! The science bit. Compressed air is added and pressurizes the content of the bottle. The bottle is released from the pump. The washer is pushed out through the nozzle by the compressed air. The bottle moves away from the washer because it follows Newton's third law. See you next time on another exciting edition of Science is Awesome! Science is awesome and I love it so There's still lots and lots of things science don't know Science is awesome